Hi guys, how's it going? So I said I'd do a quick video after the release of the new Wild Hunter sniper rods. They've just come on sale today on the website wildhunter.ie. You can pick them up in the shop in Galway or at Lone. So I'll just do a quick video explaining what the rods are. You can see them in use on one of my previous videos. I've been using them guiding there lately. So look at the older videos on my channel when I'm pike fishing with the lads. You can see them in action. So basically these rods come in three different sizes. There's the sniper one, the sniper two, the sniper three. So this one here in particular is the Sniper 1. So the gram casting weight of the Sniper 1 would be 50 to 170. And then for the Sniper 2, you're going up to 70 to 250 grams. And then for the Sniper 3, you're going to be working off 90 grams up to 390 grams. So they will cast anything you want. They're designed for casting and trolling. So um, I've been using them for jerk baiting as well. When you're using them for the jerk baiting, because they're a slightly longer rod, the sniper one is eight foot six in length, and then the other two are nine foot in length. So because they're a slightly longer rod, you can get a longer distance when you're working the jerk baits. What I do is I put on a high high gear ratio reel so that I'm working the jerk bait off the reel. But when you're working swim baits, it's just as good. You can get a really good distance on the cast. And um, they're a nice stiff plank. That's the, it there in front of you. Um, so I've been using them trolling. When I'm trolling, I use four rods a lot of the time. When I'm guiding lads, um, I have planer boards out. So you need a good stiff rod to set the hooks when you're using these large line tube trout. Um, a lot of the lures that I'm using for trolling are 30 centimeter plus, 40 centimeter lures easily. So you need a good stiff rod to set the hooks on these, on these lures, especially with the line tube system. Um, so yeah, I've been really impressed with these. I actually got the prototypes about a month or two before they came out and I've been out on Loch Derg testing them non-stop and I'm really impressed with them. Yeah, they're really cool. So they've got a camo blank. Let's sit there in front of you. This is a sniper one. So they come with a camo blank. They've got Fuji eye grips, but they've got a, a, can, a cork handle. It's kind of a long handle, which gives you a good long cast, a good long stick to make your long cast with. Um, I have this one paired up with an Abu Ambassador. Um, I have the Sniper 2 paired up with uh, Abu Revo Beast 41L. And in the Sniper 3, I actually have one of the Witchwood Agitator, one of the new baitcasters on that one. And it's going nice, it's a 300 size reel. Um, they're bait casting rods lads, so you'll have to put multipliers or bait casters onto them. They're not spinning rods, so they're designed for casting and trolling basically. Um, they're designed by Slavic and Brian from Wild Hunter. Um, really cool rods. Like I said, I've been using them loads, so they haven't let me down. Um, and they're on sale now. So if you want to check them out, go to wildhunter.ie. Um, I'm going to show you a bit of casting with them as well. So I'm going to do a bit of casting with the, the jerk bait. This is a 100 gram jerk bait from Mel Handmade Lures. I've had loads of pike on these, really cool jerk baits. Um, I'm going to be fishing the jerk bait on the Sniper 1 rod and I'm going to try cast, well not try cast, I'm going to cast a 30 centimeter line through trout from Savage Gear on the Sniper 3. Now that, that lure is 330 grams, it's a big lure, so you'll see it in action cast now a big lure. Now so lads, excuse the rain, sorry about it, I had to get a video done. So the fish are already wet, makes no difference casting lures in the rain. So this is the Sniper 1 rod, I'm going to stand back and you can see it casting the 100 gram jerk bait. This will absolutely send the lure an absolute mile. Because it's a long stiff rod, you'll be able to cast it literally as far as you want. So you've got a good long handle there. It's good lever to make your long cast. You'll see it here now. Now that's after going easily 50, 60 feet or 50, 60 yards. Um, just a, a quick flick. It's nice and light, light rod. So I'll show you the way I work the jerk bait off the reel when I'm using the, 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 the sniper rod. It's basically just, just twitches on the reel. Because it's a long rod, you don't need to keep giving it twitches like that. You can do all the, the movements off the reel if you have a high, speed, uh, high gear ratio reel. So that's the Sniper 1 casting the jerk baits. I'll pick up the other rod now and do a quick shot. Now, so the rain is really coming down here now, but it doesn't matter. So this is a 30 centimeter line shoot trout from Savage Gear. A lot of lads would look at this lure and think, no way I'm gonna cast that lure. But with these rods, you actually can, because it's rated to 390 grams. So this is a 330 gram lure, 30 centimeters in length. I have the Witchwood Agitator reel on it. So I'm gonna make a caster now and show you how far it can cast. Obviously, I wouldn't be casting these all day long, but if you do want to cast them, you can. Now, that's after going an extra 10 foot in that jerk bait. Because it's a heavy lure and it's a long stiff rod, you can lamp them lures as long as you want. And obviously, if you're casting them in large swim baits, just give it a slow retrieve back in. And uh, yeah, it's just something different. Instead of cast or trolling them big lures, you can cast them. You know, I wouldn't do it for eight hours all day long, but you know, if there's big fish there in front of you, you're casting a big lure, I'd be pretty confident. 
Now, so there's just a quick video on the new Wild Hunter sniper rods. If you want to see them in action, lads, like I said, go to watch the previous pike fishing videos on my channel. Um, I've been using the Sniper 1 in particular at loads and I've been trolling with the Sniper 2 and Sniper 3 out the side of the boat. They're really good rods, high quality rods. Um, the Sniper 1 starts at I think 179 euro, the Sniper 2 is 189 euro and then the Sniper 3 199 euro. So there's a 10 euro difference in the three ratings of the rods. Um, they're really good, really good rods. Give them a go, let me know how you get on. I'll leave a link into the description of the video if you do want to check them out. If you don't, look, it's up to you. Um, big shout out to Wild Hunter lads for sponsoring the channel this year. Um, and anything anything that uh, I can do to help them, I will. So they're cool rods. There's the jerk bit. I'll have one more cast and I'll probably stay out fishing for a bit longer. That's casting at a mile. So yeah, thanks for watching lads. Leave a like in the video if you can. Uh, drop a comment on what you think of the rods. Um, thanks for watching lads and I'll catch you, catch you soon for another fishing video.